Hello and welcome back to Software Inc. As I promised, today we are looking into building our new... Let me see how the car park is filling up. Yeah, quite a lot of people using it. That's quite nice. Might need to add a little bit more space in there if we grow a little bit more. But that's not for today. What I promised you was to look at the antivirus goal. Uh, it's to actually look into... Um, building an area for our servers and maybe an area for the, the assembly line and that's what we are doing. What I'm thinking is to actually get this plot of land here because it'll be big enough for what we need I believe. So if we go into plots it costs 217,000. We could buy this one as well, but I think this one would be a little bit nicer for us. There we go. Can I change the way roads actually look? Oh, I can. So I could make this my own space. Hmm. Ideas there, ideas. But yeah, that's not exactly what we want there, right? What I want here is basically, well, to be honest, this would be kind of a box there. Why is this going all the way up to the road? Ah, it's because we are high. Yeah, if you go down back to the ground floor, then it works a little bit better, I would say. So we have these. Now, if you take a look at roads, we have a delivery area don't we or not really uh, that's not what I want plot roof road furnish construct hmm don't don't know so let's let's do it let's get in here and leave the same space as we did on the other one to each side and that'll be more than enough there we go another building coming up so what we need to do here then we definitely i think on this floor that'll be the uh what's it called ah, i forgot the name the assembly line i don't know i have trouble reminding these names and and if we need more space for assembly line we can go down one floor look at that why oh, do i have these in here i built a server just here i think we can build our own server into this area we have this space so maybe let's start with that then if I go to building stuff, utility, we now have the big server rack, which gives us 50 gigabytes per second. Wow, that's 10 times more than the other one. Use a lot of electricity and yeah, the problem here will be paying for our bills, right? How do we go about this, I think? For internal servers, we might not need too much, I think. We could go... Like this. I know that we can build one for internal work, and then... We can have another one for the hosting of our own applications. Oops. That side, please. Thank you. I, I can't see much in here, so <laughs> let's put some lights in there. Oh, that'd be a lot cooler to have those lights on the floor. What is that? This one. And would be nice if you have then like a blue light. Ooh. That would be really really cool 
Let's do this. And I could actually give us some more light in there, just so we can see what we're going on. Yeah, it doesn't actually let me see what's going on. So maybe if I put down the white ones as well. That doesn't give a lot of light there, but... So let's move this into here and then we will get another one of those and add oh actually it's all wrong there this one over there and this one we move over here and can we select those two and duplicate there we go. Now, this might be... I, I don't know if this is much or not. I will leave this one in here. And I think what we can do in here is basically just add some better light into the area. So this gives some light. Where is the one at the top there? This one. So this gives good light, but a lot of noise. Uh, no wonder. And then I also want to actually make this a little bit more interesting. Not more interesting, like I want this to be more powerful. Oh, hold on. We need a row in the middle there. So let's select all of those. And move this. And I can't move that in there. Why not? So this is the back, that is the back. Oh, furniture. There we go. Now I can. I don't know what happened there. And I might just use more of those in the middle. There. And the spacing is fantastic. I could use the same lights in here, but I think that would look a little bit nicer and at least brighter. So let's connect the servers. Would that work? It did work. Great. So if I go in here, actually I was in the right place. Go in servers and 2.5 terabytes. That's quite a lot. And change the name for hosting. Rename. And I think we need a few more so hold up not this one i didn't want the lights give me just that row please thank you then we duplicate this one as well ah that is something on the wall here so from here let's move this I don't know, over there, and you, let's move you there. And now we do that again. Select you all. Oh, hold on. There we go. Now we have the full row duplicate. What's on the wall there? Ah. I definitely don't need all this. So select all this furniture and remove it. And then we do this one more time. 
There we go. And now we can again select all this and connect servers. And we take a look at this hosting 56 units, not using for anything. And how can we make this a digital distribution? I know that there is a way that we can do that. Distribution, software, digital distribution. And let's increase. Oh, okay, I guess 5% is what we can have. Open digital distribution platform. Okay, yes, that'll be, I think I select the wrong one or oh, hosting. Yeah, that's the right one. All right. And distribute other companies products at 6%. Okay, that's done. Um, what we need now is a fallback, fallback server for all of this. So what I'll do, I will copy this whole thing. There we go. And then we duplicate that. Oh, hold on. Why am I copying this? No. Thank you for that, but I don't want you. I want this. Duplicate. Oh, really? Come on. I'm clicking on it. Now, now you're being silly. What? What's this? Even selecting. I don't know. Like, I really don't know. Can I select this, reselect, and do a duplicate here? Seems like I can't. So let's try again, I guess. Oh, oh, ah, that was the light over there. There we go. Good. But it didn't want to select everything down there. Oh. Okay. Let's start with this and then we do the, the rest. So as we go from here, copy all these things, except that one. Duplicate this, there we go, and make this look quite nice. And then we have issues in here as well. So as we did the other time, we select all this furniture, we delete, and good to go. This one, we just move. This one, we just move. And I guess I can just copy and paste now. Duplicate, yep, yeah. and there we go. Now, this would be the hosting backup. So, we'll select the servers over there and connect them. Look at servers. Server zero will be called hosting backup. And then hosting will have the fallback in the hosting backup. There we go. Now everything is safe. Uh, we already have one process in here, uh, digital distribution. Fine. Okay, so digital distribution is up and running, I guess. I hope these all work. And I just wonder if we have any deals for digital distribution. Let me slow things down. We have support, development, design, hosting. Let's do it. And do we have another hosting? Yes, we have. Oh, just 393? Yeah. And now we finish that what is that? This one. The first deal. Good. 
And we got more couches. Nice. They look better. So some deals are done or digital distribution is up and running. We can take a look at this. This line is what? Is it like, are we doing digital distribution for everyone? I think we are. And the load on the servers. <laughs> Look at the size of this beast, 2.8 terabytes with a 1% load. I think we're safe. Yeah, I think that's a pretty good size uh, digital distribution there. We won't have any issues with any of this. So what I will do, I will cut this episode right now and on the next episode we do distribution over there because I think this was actually it was a pretty nice episode. We managed to build our servers in here. We still have to figure out what to do with this empty space because I thought this would take a lot more space. But I love how this is looking. Look at this. Oh, this looks so good. It's beautiful. Beautiful view. But yeah, uh, let me know in the comments what you think about these new servers that we have now. Uh, I think this is quite overpowered, especially the ones that we are using internally. So I would like to hear your opinions. Leave me a comment down below. And also consider joining my Discord server so we can talk about our digital distribution deals in here. And don't forget to leave a like because that helps me a lot and it shows your appreciation for all this work that, that I do. So that would be very helpful. And if you want to see what comes next and how we are doing our um, production line over there on this building at the side, leave me a comment uh, or just subscribe and you'll see in the next episode how that goes. So thank you and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.